Hello again, it's Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. In the gallery room, moving my ladder away, looking for my glasses, going, oopsie, what did I do with them? Oh, I don't want to climb the ladder again. I guess I'm going to do it blind. <laughs> Good thing I got some practice. Okay, so this is paint left over from before in a silicone cupcake container, like so. And that should go in the bucket because it's draining. And things come out of silicone cupcake containers very nicely. I'm going to move that over there. I'm probably going to add some more color to it. I'm going to use this pre-primed 16 by 20 inch canvas. And add a layer of paint because I want some paint to flow. I think I'm going to, I'm pretty sure, I think I'm going to be using a basting brush. And I'm going to try and, I'm going to try and cheat. <laughs> I'm going to try and use my colors in a strange way. It might be a bad time to cheat with no glasses, but I found them! Oh, awesome! <laughs> ha! Yay! That's such a good thing, you have no idea. I'm completely ready to uh, go find myself the proper, proper doctors, but no nothing is open right now. Cataract surgery, so. Time will be right, I'm sure of it. Somehow, some way, someday. So this is my OXO omelet turning spatula, best paint spreading tool I know of. I'm gonna try not to worry about my edges right now. I just want some paint to flow other paint and I don't want any gaps and I like the finish. It's a semi-gloss. Actually, my paint recipe is below the video underneath the description. And uh, my black and my white are both half artist loft, half Walmart color place semi gloss with the regular mixture in there. I use the same mixture in all of my paints, even if it's a, an acrylic enamel, no matter what, it's always the same. Never any water, always flow troll. Sometimes the pouring mediums change, like I ran out of deco or pouring medium, so um, I have GAC 800 in all of my mixtures because it helps prevent cracking. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the center of this. But I'm kind of thinking that it might be a good idea to make an attempt to give myself a center. And also to find my tweezers because I see that thing right there. You know what I really want to do? I don't know if it's a good idea or not. I'm pretty sure most of the time the spatula gets rid of all of the bubbles. And I really don't want to dry anything. But um, So here's my pretend center. Let's put it the other way up so it leaves less mark. Really? That wasn't good. Come here, you. And you. I'm going to pretend that's not a problem right now. Blow that out. I'm going to check that it's kind of level and remove that other piece of paint I see there. Okay. So far, I'm feeling like that's okay for center. One more piece of schmutz. And now, what do I want to do? Now I want to take, <laughs> now I want some more white or some more gold or something. So this is what's left of my Decor Americana Gold. And you know what? In this case, I'm going to take a skewer, am I? A nice thin one. And I'm going to run it through those colors. And they're getting kind of thick. And there's a dog hair clinging to them. And I am going to, I'm going to make little puddles. And then I am going to probably do something even weirder, which is just take my squeeze bottles and give myself the purple color shift that I like. If this works, it'll be really nice. If that thing that's a flow trial booger comes out, that'll be even nicer too. I don't think that you have to be precise about this. It's probably not a bad idea to get something going in the center. I have no idea how this is going to work. I want something else. What do I want? 
I'm going to use some of this Decor Americana Indoor Outdoor Interior Exterior Semi Gloss or Eggshell, they call it gold. So, who knows what's going to happen now? I don't. <laughs> I don't have a clue. Um, seems like my turquoise has sealed itself up. Let's, let's just go crazy. Let's not worry about anything. Let's just spin it all out because I can. The name of my first book on the Amazon link. All right, it's time to pull. I have basting brushes. So let's see what we want. That one's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bristles in it. That might be okay. Let's start with this one's got one, two, three. That one's got seven also, but it's more controllable. Let's start with less is more. Let's start with this one. I'm going to go on a curve, and I'm going to go and try and measure my curve at four points of the compass right now. I think it'd be really miraculous if this works, and also really kind of cool. But you never know, unless you try. And I've wanted to try it. I've imagined that it's going to work for a while now. <laughs> if that counts for anything. And I think I can move from the outside in if I want to also. Right after I'm done filling in all my gaps. Actually, I like the crosshatch effect. So I'm okay with pulling over pulls. If that makes any sense. Why not try everything? It's a good experiment. Not positive about my colors. But the cool thing is I could actually go in here, I'm thinking, with a few more colors. That's a basket weave, son. It's very organic, that's for sure. Yeah, I'm just continuing on to pull it out. I think what I'm going to do with the center, I don't know what I'm going to do with the center. I need a tool. I need a small swipe rag cloth that I did not get ahead of time. Wow. Okay, let's use a spatula. Do I dare? Really? <laughs> well, I think I'm going to try and fix some of this with some of the center color. Let's use some black enamel. And some more of the 24 karat gold, if I can lay my hands on it, which is got to be right in front of me, right? There it is. I moved it. I'm not wrong. Things are getting blocked up. Come on out. Out you come. Well, I definitely think it's supposed to look very organic and not very anything else, but let's... Oh boy, I'm nervous. I'm more nervous now than I was a minute ago. Don't like it so far. But things can change. getting better. <laughs> she said optimistically. Maybe it wasn't a good idea. 
Maybe it'll be cool anyway. All right, so I think because I have a center point. Now I get to decide what, if anything, I want to do with the rest of this. And I'm thinking that I might want to go ahead and what? Pull some stuff in from the outside. I gotta try it once. Out and in. This is definitely a because I can moment. And maybe I can't. Maybe I can. Maybe I didn't need the pink. Maybe just filling in is okay. Yes, I know it's muddy, but it's going to be shiny, iridescent muddy. And if I hate it, I can add color to it tomorrow. What can I say? I want to try everything. Even the bad stuff. So, I don't know how I feel about that. There's some very cool things about it, actually. I don't mind that at all. I'm wipe off my... Alright, so what do I want to do? I want to... I want to hope that that is clear now. Because it's not going to be helpful if it's not. And I think I want it so bad, I'm going to clear it. There was a rather large ball of paint in there, and it still is. You can see through it. I think I can see through it. No, I wasn't sucking, I was blowing. So, I'm quiet because I'm focused. I'm kind of hoping my muse is having a moment and coming up with something to help me fix what I don't like about this. I kind of like those dots in the center. As opposed to that one there that I don't like at all. Don't tell. It's getting cooler. I think I will like it in the end. And only one more to go. So that's pretty neat, actually, and I have to decide what I might want to do to that now. And that could include spreading a little bit more of this paint out. Making sure it's a more cohesive weirdness. <laughs> I like the color left behind. The basket weave is pretty cool. It's a little fugly, funky, whatever. I kind of want some orange at the outside. I like how it's different color over here than here, and that was that pink. The pink was definitely interesting. I really do need a swipe card, and all I've got is this little piece of calendar.
You'd think I'd be more prepared than that after all this time. It's been a few days since I got the chance to be in here. I kind of think that um, those don't belong there. Should have just left them. They, they were organic. Um, I think I like the idea. Of a few of these 24 karat gold dots. Let's just even that up a little bit and add them everywhere. Sort of fool the eye into thinking that it's even. Kind of wants it orange. I got two minutes to tell you guys I sell my artwork and uh, you can find it. You can find my email address under the Linktree link. Yes, if in, if it, if in doubt, Purple Flash by Folk Art, Color Shift. To the rescue. I just keep thinking about that. Um, Venetian blue from Modern Masters. And I think I'm going to like it. Just a waggle. Ooh, that's going to be exciting tomorrow. Can't wait to find out what this looks like. Dry. I've done similar stuff. Nothing exactly like this at all. Okay, so that's actually way, way cooler than I thought it was going to be. I love you guys. There's uh, almost 90,000 of you, and that's pretty cool. Do I want anything else? <laughs> you know I do. Will it be even? No, it won't. Do I care? Maybe. We'll see. Just makes me want orange. And you guys will be gone soon. And I gotta tell you, if you look at the link tree, you'll find Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, Facebook groups, Sachi Art. My website is under there. And if you look at the end screens on the video, in the last 20 seconds, you'll find my exhibition video that shares with you what the month's prizes are. Excuse me what the drawing winner gets to choose from. If, should they happen to be a contributor to help keep the studio rolling? Your contributions through PayPal and Patreon help me make videos. I like those little spirals a lot, a lot, a lot. And uh, I like the weird background. Like way, way more than I thought I would. And I think this is the only thing that's really bothering me right here. That that line didn't be, wasn't complete. Okay, so let the strangeness continue. I love you guys. I'll see you in on. Bye for now. Priscilla out. Please share my videos. I love your thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you for the great comments. Thank you for all the contributions. Um, look on the community board for tomorrow's video. Look in my playlist for over 1,500 videos organized so that you can find what you want. Ask me questions if at will, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. And It usually doesn't take me too long. I'm going to look for any little... Even stranger than strange. Little marks that don't belong there. And uh, I will see you guys in on. Bye for now. Priscilla out. Well, sort of anyway. Okay, I'm not sure I'll do that again, but I'm not unhappy that I did it now. Take care of each other and take care of yourselves. Bye for now. I'll see you anon.